we're gonna head to Home Depot. A lot of times, um, I don't know, that system, that system is down sometimes, and I hate having to do this, so I have to go in there, because I don't give these guys cards unless I trust them. There's only one guy I give a card to, is uh, Garland. Garland and Wayne, not one, so it's two. Actually, Wayne gets a card that I have a limit on. <laughs> I, I give that Negro a limit. Yeah, I just spent over a hundred thousand with uh, Home Depot already this year. Yeah, not just me, but that's yeah, I have an account with them. I'm a pro service. Yeah, that's why I want to get some uh, sponsorship through them to see because like I'm always here, and then what the investors that I have, guess where I get their stuff from? Home Depot. I spent a lot of good money. Like last year, I spent a good eighty some thousand last year. This year, I'm a top what I spent. Oh, I already topped it, but you know, I'm gonna spend way more. Check this out. Now, a lot of times when I come here, a lot of people notice me from the uh, Possessing the Land show. It's so it's so inspiring though, because I didn't even think it was all like, like getting out there like that. So when I started seeing more people like, hey, you that guy that uh, that do the shows, Possessing the Land? I'm like, yes, sir. Let me get a photo. I'm like, wow, that's pretty cool, man. The people that are, are actually fans. Cause that from one season I had where I wasn't shooting film, and it was like, "What's one of the next show gonna be?" So let's go ahead and get in, check it out. Let's make this payment. My man Jason, my man L, what y'all about to get into? Like y'all about to do some drywall? Uh, no, just getting the stuff, some cover stuff for this. Right, That's what's up. Okay, I gotta get closer. You about to do? No, we getting ready to uh, actually go do a couple, uh, put, a, put a couple pieces of drywall up at this house, and that's about it. Hey, what's up, man? What you been up to, man? Yeah, man, really just been chilling, getting yeah. upstairs, man. Okay, my man waiting on me, so I got to get over here and make this this paint in the morning. All right, bro. Pop. Sorry about this, man. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, so Jason, another one of my contractors. He in here doing another job, so I might have to get on him. Where we are here? Uh, my, my car wasn't going through. All right, so right now, um, I'm making this payment. I was trying to do a phone sale. A lot of times what happens with phone sale is that the system doesn't take my card and it says decline. Uh, okay, but, uh, we're gonna uh, keep it moving. But yeah, a lot of times when the system doesn't take my car, I gotta come in here and, and, and do it manually. Uh, it's another thing too, I like to save money. So I got coupons for days. <laughs> got a coupon. Let's see how much money I'll save today. While she go back there, this is my guy Pac. Pac does my finish, like my work for a drywall. You do, uh, what else you do, bro? Painting drywall. You say you do plumbing? I ain't know you do plumbing, man. Okay. You know, I've been needing plumbing. Uh, yeah, I got him. Just waiting on you. All right, so right now we're about to put this coupon in to see what we're going to save today. One second. Detroit. What's it at, right? $382? You saved $72.67. Man, I just saved $72.67. See, that's why it's good to have coupons. You ready for your card? Oh, yeah, so I got to make the payment. How are you? How was your day today? So it actually worked out good that I came in today and not paid over the phone because I was able to use my coupon and save some money. Like I mentioned, a lot of times I come in here, this is where, this is pro service. Pro service is people that have an account where we, you know, we do phone sales. Uh, we also, people that are out of state, they may not be able to come in, you know what I mean? So it's like it helps. They also do text, uh, what is it called? Text what? The text thing, what is it called? Text to confirm, I, I just figured it out. Yeah, text to confirm. So I should work here. Nah, I'm messing with you. Nah, text to confirm is like whenever you, um, like say how I was busy with today, we was filming and stuff, and you know, my phone was ringing in my ear and everything, my earbud, I had to take them out. So what happens is I could have read a text message. Like say if I'm in a meeting, I could read a text message and confirm that transaction, and boom. 
it'll go right to my phone. So that's something that I need to do. I haven't had the time to sit down and, and register that, but it's so much better than getting on the phone and give me your number and hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You know what I mean? It's, it's too much. So I need to do that tonight. I need to get in and set up a text confirm. So shout out to Home Depot for making it easier for investors. And uh, I, mean, I need you to be a, a sponsor, Home Depot. So put that tag in there, Home Depot. Everybody, uh, make it viral. Call me. My number 512. No, I'm playing. <laughs> really, people really gonna be calling. All right, we out though, man. Let's go. Like, oh, you know what I learned? I learned how to put together an adapter, like a light tester. So what I did was, I bought, what did I buy? Oh, I bought one of these. So I was like, when a guy was putting drywall on, they, uh, I needed to test the light, so what I did was I bought one of these and put a, and put a, I bought a light bulb, and then I bought, where is it at? And I learned this off of Google. I was like, man, how did, because we need a light in the house and we didn't have no light fixture, and I ain't had nobody to put the light on for me, so I started Googling, all right. You know, I was typed in how to put together an adapter, like, so I could test the light or whatever. Anyways, I forgot what I typed in, but I ended up finding this technique right here. And then it was this, and it was, some pieces like this. It's like uh, like the red and the, uh, where they at, where they at, where they at, where they at? Here they are. These pieces right here. So I was able to put this in there, the black, and then put the white and the red, and I clamped them on there. And then I was able to put on the hot wire and on the ground wire, and it lit up. Boy, we had light in that house. Everybody was like, yo, we out the dock. <laughs> I just play, but let me put this stuff back. If you ain't you don't know how to keep it, do the principles and maintain, you're gonna lose it. You know what I mean? So whatever it took you to get what you have, you have to continue to do that thing, that principle. What you may be paying your tithes, giving, or maybe you know just doing good things. So I learned that from him, man. And since I was under his wing, he would teach me these things. I took off. All I needed was that one person to show me. That's why I don't I don't look at money because money. It's, it's, you know what I mean? It's a, it's a tool to get things done. That's what money is. It's like, instead of having a Phillips, or on, get a drill, on faster. As long as everything's on, everything's good. Yeah, see what I'm saying? It's on, bro, it's going, money will come to you. Like, that's how, like, pretty much when they said, seek first the kingdom of God and all his ways and his righteousness. Like, when you put your focus on God, Everything your heart desire, God will fulfill it. It's biblical. It's uh, Matthew 6 and 33. So you think about it, bro. When you focusing on God, God already know your heart's your desire, what you want. So when you put your focus on him, bro, everything else gonna follow you. Money gonna follow you, chase you. But when you chase the money, money gonna run from you. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I said follow that what God instilled in you, that purpose, that 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 that, that drive, that that hunger, like whatever God instilled in you, bro. That's what, that's your purpose, bro. Whatever makes you upset when you don't see it done right, it's connected to your purpose. Whatever makes you happy, whatever makes you, when you're passionate about, that's connected to your purpose. So, and so it's good to meet you. I don't think we met by coincidence. I think it wasn't a coincidence. So I think it was a, it was a reason that I hopped in this lane. Yeah. Yep. You, you don't mind if I pray for you before I leave? What's uh, your name? So your name again? Torrance. Torrance. Father God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I thank you for Torrance, Lord God. Lord, I ask you to forgive us for all of our sins, knowing and unknown sin, Lord. I thank you, Lord, for the vision you have gave, given him, Father God. Lord, I bind every attack of the enemy on his life, Father God. I pray, Lord, you give more clear vision. And I pray, Lord, he writes the vision down and make it clear, Lord God, so that he will run, Lord God, when he reads it. Father God, I thank you, Lord God, for the opportunities, Lord. I thank you, Lord God, uh, for his uh, children. Uh, put a hedge of protection over them, Father God. Dispatch your angels over him, Lord God. And Lord, everything that he put his mind to, will be blessed, Lord God. Lord, allow you to be to get the glory out of this situation, Father God, Lord. And, and everything that his heart desires, Lord God, if he puts you first, Lord God, it will prosper. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, I pray. Amen. amen, amen. All right, man. Pleasure meeting you, man. Let's get it. That's why I don't look down on nobody. When I when I see us anybody I'm walking the path with, I'm talking to him. I'm like, hey. God has, because think about it, bro. God has a plan and a purpose for everybody. I mean, the person that's on that street corner, he still got a purpose and a plan. Got, you know, the person that is uh, in the strip club, God still got a plan and a purpose for him. <laughs> you gotta accept it, man. And the sooner or later they will. They'll get tired of living life in that vicious circle. Same thing, same results. Same thing, same results. And you're like, enough is enough. 
So I think nothing but good is gonna come out of that, bro. He got your number, he got my number. And uh, yeah, man, this is Kerry Lime with Possessor of the Land. Me and my boy Kevin B. We out.